Okay, here's a quick video to show you how to set up the auto bouncer. Um, dig from dead simple and really quick. You've got a ground spike, so when you're using it on the drillings, on the stubble, down on the floor, um, that will be the one you use. The bouncer itself literally drops straight onto it and locks in place with the little thumb screw. Always keep the arm in the same direction as the long arm on the ground spike. That way the weight is distributed over it nice and neatly. And it won't tilt. So that's that. When you're up on the standing props, you've got the standable ground spike that goes onto the floor spike and then you drop your auto bouncer onto that again facing the arm facing the travel on the uh, on the, the ground spike there and that's fully adjustable so you've got various heights on that for various different props and you get a bog standard ff6 flapper with it so if you've got your own ff6 or an FF6 Rapid DC, you can use that as well. Just set the dials on the Rapid DC to run constantly and the speed you want the wings to flap at, and you're there. You just literally do what I'm doing now. Drop it onto the box, run the wires up towards the control box. Let's wrap that around once. Top one is a positive. Bottom one is the negative. Okay, so plug it onto the battery, obviously. So you've got a uh, remote control handset. It's got two sequences. Button A will send it up. It will stay in the air, flapping, drop down without flapping, and then give two little flicks of the wing, like a bird settling. <laughs> Send it straight up, straight down, with no pauses in between. So it's just like a bird jumping up and down, moving itself about. In the so that'll work out to around about, well, anything up to 70 yards. Not that you're going to need that. So a long range of mode on it. That's it, as simple as. Maintenance wise, you don't need to do anything to the auto bouncer itself. As far as the FF6 is concerned, you've got pivot holes where all the drive rods go and the wings pivot. Dash your rod on there before or after you've been out. That will uh, that will help maintain it. It's got a full one year's warranty on it. And we are building them now. So if you're watching this video, you've probably already bought one. So hopefully it's shown you how to use it. Any problems, I'm always on the end of the phone. Cheers.